Okay, very good afternoon. Lay Gemship FM 92.2. I've been talking to some lovely people off there. We've got Dale and we've got Rachel, the Karma duo. Very good afternoon. Hello. Hiya. Hi. Hi. Now, uh, I know Rachel's really got to behave herself this afternoon. <laughs> <laughs> um, absolutely brilliant. Um, <clears throat> what we were just saying off mic, uh, one thing I like about you guys is what you see is what you get. And I like that. Um, it, it just seems a lot of fun, a lot of banter uh some humor chucked in and a good mix of songs and you just sit you always look like you're having a good time we 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 enjoy what we play don't we right yeah and we never play any songs that we don't like if people request something we don't like it we just don't do it we yeah. just only play what we like and it works for us otherwise we wouldn't enjoy ourselves and have the banter I think that's what you've got to do. If, if you go down the line of you really are disliking what you're doing, hmm. then, then you are selling yourself out and it isn't so much fun. Yeah, yeah, I totally agree with that. Yeah, we do pull some songs out from all over the place, really, but literally it's just a mixture of what our favourite songs are between us and comes together OK. Yeah, the, the problem is, Mick, you, you don't want it to turn into a job. No. Do you understand what I mean? Though? Yeah, no, absolutely. Absolutely, Del. No, definitely not. It's fun. Yeah, yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Yeah, totally agree. And that, that's what it comes across as, because, uh, as I said, you, you've been doing, um, obviously, uh, we, we tell people, at, you guys have been uh, rocking and rolling for quite a while now, and then Rachel uh, had a really just basically silly accident at home and it just the ankle wasn't it yeah well, Tri i nearly slapped my foot off it was yeah. basically being held on with the skin it was disgusting oh. but literally just in my living room <laughs> yeah that's what i mean and, and and that's what i mean you literally done that and you done such a good job on it it wasn't just a, a little break you had to do the job didn't you i know um, it was awful mm. at least the hospital was all inclusive but i just never got to find the bar because i couldn't walk yeah. now that's it <laughs> which is normal brilliant and I mean, Del, um, I remember it was so nice because you was going on Facebook and saying how much Del was doing, and I know he'd done an amazing job. And, and you could see that you two were a team. Yeah, yeah, and she, uh, getting back on a, uh, a broken ankle, she made such a good job of it. Yeah. She had some American, was it, surgeon come to actually... Oh, she come to watch the operation. She wanted to actually <laughs> see it. She made that much of a... Well, job. <laughs> That's amazing, and I, I mean, I think it was really nice because you kind of gave us a little a diary sneak preview of what you were doing, and I thought one of the nicest things was is when Rachel finally not only took a couple of steps but actually got back to go to the horse field. Oh yeah, that was oh, so yeah. good. Yeah, that that must have been absolutely brilliant for you guys because I know you have a passion and a love of horses because they're like your babies. Yeah. Well, he was FaceTiming me, the horses, when he went to feed them in the evening when I was bedridden, and he was just, like, video calling the horses to me, and they ended up learning to, like, get right up to the screen. It was quite <laughs> funny in the end. Oh, I love it. That just That is brilliant. And that, <laughs> but that's what I mean, like, your babies, your family. Yeah. And, and that's what it's about. And uh, as I said, um, a few years back, it must have been about... Hmm, three, four years ago. You came in here and done a little set for us, didn't you? You came oh. in here and actually done... Oh, yeah, it was Carla as well. Carla yep. yeah, was Carla. <laughs> Oh, that was excellent. Yeah, we'll have to do it again when this. Oh, no, this. brilliant. No, we got uh, uh, Carla's going to give me a phone call tomorrow, so uh, Carla's going to be on here tomorrow. And um, as I said, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put this on now because I want to do your top five anyway. Okay. So if anyone's listening, we're talking to the Karma Duo, and they are a brilliant uh, a duo going right across the board. So how did it all start for you two? Well, we. I'll be quite honest with you. I. We used to live in Eccles. Um, oh, I know that. Eccles, the, uh, the Red Bull. And there was a chap in there. His name was Taz. T-A-double-Z. If you're still out there, Taz, you should get back out again. But um, he used to use MIDI mm -hmm. um, with a, a keyboard and he'd play guitar on it. And I thought, well, he's got a band there. Yeah. And then um, I'm talking about it and met Rachel in, in this pub that unfortunately not there anymore. Mm -hmm. um, we had a, a range of practice and, and then built up from there. But then we, we took a break because of the kids and the horses and that. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'll say overall, on and off, it's been 22 years. But in Really? This, yeah. In this incarnation, it's about 12. Yeah. And you're never too old to rock. You get old no. when you stop. <laughs> I quite agree with you. Yeah. Absolutely right as well. 
you, you, you're on, on the money there. And uh, as I said, it, it's really funny because uh, your humour and uh, the banter uh, and and also you kind of look relaxed as well there's no kind of like uh i don't know it's not cheesy no it's probably the gin and tonic i thought i was gonna say that i didn't <laughs> i didn't actually want to say it was the drinks cabinet rachel but i was kind of thinking that you know and I'm sure <laughs> anybody out there that knows you the thing is i think it's great as well because um as i said what you see is what you get with you guys and i like that i very much like that um oh that's the way we will always be we don't have any yeah. of this pretentious rubbish no <laughs> no no and i must admit so ha you've been doing a couple of live um videos from home yeah, yeah, that's, um, we class that as get drunk with karma. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, that's a good thing to be doing at the moment, I should imagine, as well. And uh, when have you got the next one lined up? We haven't. What? We, we generally do every fortnight, don't we? Yeah. Yeah, we don't like to overdo it, and we did one last Saturday, so it'll probably be like the next two weeks. And we just normally do it for an hour, because I think that's enough. Yeah. There's so many acts out there, and they're really good as well. And, People want to see everybody. Yes. I think it's good to do that, and, and it's nice that you just set it up in the front room and away you go, and, and it just works, and it's, it's coming across really, really well, and, and the banter and the relaxation, as you said, a couple of glasses of falling down water as well. <laughs> and uh, I, know you, I know you have a lot of fans out there. I know you have, like, um, a lot of other artists that you really get on with as well, which is nice. Yes. Because it can be quite the opposite in this business, but oh, you just yeah, seem to get really on. good ones out there. Like yeah. with friends with like Rick Steele's. Yeah. Oh, Winters. Ricky. There's, yeah. There's lots of nice ones, and it, if anyone better. gets funny, we just don't, don't bother. Them. They just let them all do their little thing, and we do ours, and we sort of all meet in the yeah. middle and have yeah. a giggle. Exactly. He's an extremely talented man. With with you know, he, he can turn his hand to keyboard. Mm. Um, yeah. Uh, there's. You caught us on the hop here, Mick, because I'm thinking of other people. Well, you got, I know you get on with Millsy. Oh, Lisa. Oh, Lisa, Lisa. and Kathy Bishop. They yeah, are Kathy. So yeah. And they're so brilliant. And they've got a really good banter as well when they pair up for a duo. Hmm. But their banter's so natural. Yeah, but I think what it's nice is pictures. what I call down-to-earth people. And that's what I like in this business. I like to talk to the people that are down-to-earth. And they're not legends in their lunch hours. They just go out and do what they do and they enjoy it. It's what and support each other. That is really nice. Because I think we're going to need to do that a lot after this as well. To get back on the merry-go-round of music when we eventually do. Um, you, do you have a website or stuff like that? Well, we, we did have a website, but we took it down basically because of the the lockdown but we're yeah. on facebook look us up come you on facebook it's a pair of lips the logo mm -hmm. and um we will get the website up again once well we, does anybody know when this is going to end no no not at the moment uh, I, I don't think it's going to be for quite a while yet so we're all kind of just going to keep playing from home and and doing what we're doing and hopefully it will start up again soon and we can all get back out there and uh, <clears throat> enjoy and entertaining and what we love the best as well so do you have any um recordings or anything you've done yes we have got some, we have got um a comfortably numb peace of my heart uh, first cuts the deep kiss. There's some on YouTube and there's some on our Facebook site. Oh, yeah, so, we're yeah. on YouTube. Oh, you're on YouTube. See, that's what we need to do. We need to let people know where they can actually go and see you as well as, like, on Facebook. It'll be good for people to know that they can actually view you. Uh, and also that you are available for bookings I in the future. Yeah. 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 Well, I'll, Rachel, I'm lead guitar and technical repairs and Rachel's vocals and she does all the admin, bless her. Well, that's a good thing as well, isn't it? Because it, it works like that, doesn't it? You know, having somebody there that can do all that. You take your bit, you take your bit, and, and it works. Yeah. Absolutely. It's a team. As you said, it's a duo, it's a team, and I think that's absolutely brilliant. Um, I've got some of your top five. Oh, bless your heart. I, ha I have got some of your top five. And uh, if... if I'm going to say, if, is there a, a contact number if anyone would like to think of giving you uh, a chance or a booking in the future? Do you have a contact number at all? Yes, you'd like to give it out? That will be Rachel. Admin. Can we go to the admin department, please? It's on the Facebook page, I think. They've yeah. got a number, yeah. Sorry, yeah. But I'll just put it out in any case. Um, it's 0737 mm -hmm. 645. And there you go, and you do stuff right across the board. Yeah, yeah, we do weddings, parties, clubs, pubs, anything really. We just adapt the material to what a venue wants. Exactly, and we were saying off air that um, 
I couldn't believe it because you had all that time out uh, getting better with your ankle and it was just so brilliant to see you get out and do a gig and you got out did that first gig after many months and then lockdown yeah. so that was a real wallop wasn't it? it you know but hopefully it won't be too long before you guys are back out there rocking yeah the funny thing was the last gig we did before the accident was the day before i broke my ankle which was hammersmith and the first one we went back to do after was hammersmith again <laughs> and then the lockdown so i'm starting to think this place is cursed <laughs> yeah so if you looked at, if you look in your diary you can tell us when your next gig is at hammersmith then we know we got a chance that no i'm just like... gonna panic i think i'll hide on that one and let Joe go out on his own <laughs> yeah just hide stay in the car just sing keep the microphone long mic in the car do it that way no, I'm gonna absolutely to brilliant <laughs> uh, uh, fantastic it's, it's one of my favorite gigs as well so it's a shame i get a bit nervous when i go there now all oh, right. Well, I'm not surprised. Yeah. <laughs> brilliant. Well, listen, it's been absolutely brilliant to to chat to you, and thank you so much, Rachel, for being on your best behaviour. I'm sweating, uh, mate. Oh, no. <laughs> so, listen, so so was I, mate, I tell you. <laughs> oh, and have a good swear. And, uh, yeah, when you, when you switch off, you can you can do that then. You can have a right old go at it. and uh, But, Del, it's been lovely to talk to you as well. And, of course, please, when we do eventually uh, lift this lockdown in the future it will be great if you guys can pop over oh, or that even be an honor we, we loved it so much it. last time yeah. it was so much fun and thank you for having us again. no no it's an absolute pleasure thank you for taking time out because i just wanted to use this time that we're having lockdown to to promote people and let people know that there are people out there doing music and uh, you know and they're from all walks of life and and you guys are you know that's what i wanted i wanted to get as many people as i can on to talk about what they love because i'll tell you what you, you guys are doing such an amazing job because you're giving people that break people are kind of sitting at home and they're kind of thinking and then someone comes up and you can just sit down with a tea or a glass of falling down water and watch a bit of entertainment because it's very much not like that at the moment well we have to rehearse anyway so we just figured in the end because i was quite nervous about doing the live feeds at first mm. but i thought well we need to keep rehearsing and ticking over anyway so why not put it on live? And some of my friends were asking, so we just done it. Yeah. And we, we should we should be on a beach in Cyprus. Yeah, we should. Oh be yeah, right you're now. meant to be on holiday. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're meant to be on holiday, but uh, unfortunately, that's out of the question at the moment. So it's more rehearsals and, and more songs. Yeah. So, but we look forward to uh, seeing you in the future and hearing you as well. And don't forget to look up these people, the Karma Duo, on Facebook. Uh, they are a great turn and great fun as well. And I can I can't thank you too enough. It's been lovely to talk to you, and stay safe and keep keeping rocking that music. I'll oh, send in love to you, Mick. Ah, oh, bless your heart. I'm going to play your top five. I'm going to play your best I can the music I found anyway and uh see what you think but thanks for uh being part